Hey y'all, I'm leaving the hair salon. I look good. So this unit is not even a full um, lace closure. Sometimes I do actually like getting my break with the full lace closures. I do get to choose which, oh, I do get to choose which wig I wear for the most part, but honestly, most times they send me like, hey, would you like this one? And I do just say, okay, great, just send it. Um, so, cause I like the variety, I like switching it up and being different, unless it's a particular style I don't care to deal with at that moment. And then I'm at, or I just kinda, cause at first I was like, hey, do you have anything with color? Like I kept asking over and over, like, hey, can I do something with color? And, um, some of the companies like oh no like we really want you to showcase the natural and i'm so glad because y'all y'all and i know y'all gonna go crazy over this unit this is a really beautiful unit um she did wash it um bleached the knots or whatever and it is like it stops from right here to right here but uh hold on let me oh oh shit I'm not supposed to yeah, here it goes. Let me pay the hell attention, y'all. So I'm on my way to Trader Joe's. I went to Trader Joe's last week. I told myself every time I'm downtown, let me make sure I go to Whole Foods or Trader Joe's. So I'm gonna try to start scheduling it out like that. That um, what is it called? Farmers Market that we went to, never again, never again, never again. I didn't like it. The fruit it was molding really bad. Like the, all the strawberries, we couldn't even eat any of them. The oranges, like, we're starting to have issues. Like, ugh, I don't even know what the avocados are gonna be like. So, I probably need to go home and use those avocados. Um, Y'all yeah, obviously seen that we've been juicing a lot. I love juicing. Um, I will continue to juice. Right, are you? What are you doing? I will continue to juice. Um because it's healthier for the girls and, but i'm actually going there because of that eucalyptus plant when i went there last week they were already gone and i really really want the eucalyptus plant y'all hear that those chairs back there i still have those chairs from ashley's house she had let me borrow them so um tomorrow is going to be really sunny so i'm going to see but actually i may edit this out if it's not happening but my client should be getting her clear to close today thank god finally after all this time we're getting the clear to close and um i don't have to do any content because i told y'all i had already filmed her closing video before i even had surgery thank god we're closing because that would have been a waste of a video and it had came out so bomb so hopefully like i said i keep this in and we're still we get the clear to close. as long as we have the clear to close this clip is going to stay in there if we don't get the clear to close we'll take it out so um anyways y'all yes i will okay, see guys i made it back in here so for i immediately knew that they had to have them in stock as soon as i walked in here i smelled them but yes they're only 3 dollars out actually i don't know what to do because i thought like this like goes around my shower but i guess i'll figure that part out when i get home but this is it it's only 3.99 i also saw a yucca plant i absolutely love yucca plants i have the yucca plant at my house currently and it's dying but anyways i'm gonna buy one for the entryway table and these are the yucca plants i just like that vibe of it y'all I came here for one thing. This one freaking $3.99 plant and ended up on an adventure. I'm for sure a trader's girl. I know, it sounds crazy. Hold on, y'all, let me park y'all. Well, no, I'm not parking y'all, I'm parking a buggy. Oh my gosh, look y'all. Like, this is crazy. Like, I have been a public girl all my life. Literally, well, not all my life, but when I became an adult and started shopping for myself. Um, because I, we didn't grow up with Publix. We grew up with Walmart, Kroger, stuff like that. But when I started nannying, ooh, which was literally around the same time of me starting my YouTube journey, um, the I used to grocery shop for the family. And that's when I started. Okay, y'all. First of all, I need to calm myself down and I'm straining myself and it's not good. Still getting over a surgery. But um, anyways, so I, they, um, they were a public family. Ooh, this one's heavy. So that's when I actually, and then I was cooking for them. So I was cooking the food. So I'm like, oh my gosh, this tastes so different from like how I grew up, like what's going on. And then I'm becoming a pub's girl from then on out. Until now. I'm officially switching over. Like I love Trader Joe's and Whole Foods. 
I don't know which one I will pick over the other. Now, Whole Foods is a, has a larger selection. Let me move you over. Whole Foods has a, a larger selection. Hold on, let me put y'all. I can't put y'all nowhere. Somebody gonna take y'all. Looks like kidnapping. Hold on, y'all. So anyways, like I was saying, I like, hold on. I'm gonna listen to you in a second. That's like, y'all already know I'm getting married to that song. But um, who can guess that song? I didn't even really hear it, but if you know, you know. So, anyways, like I'm saying, it's 141. I have not had anything but a peach. So this is why I'm not consistently picking up weight. Um, because I'm not eating the way that I should be. I'm in the middle of watching a movie, Six Sink. The Six Six why is this a tongue twister? The sixth sense. The sixth, the sixth sense. Because Shay Room posts a post last week saying what's the most mind-bending movie y'all know i've been like on a movie kick like what's the most mind-bending movie harry potter for sure is the whole harry potter series will forever be my favorite nothing there's nothing that's ever going to be written directed film that's going to trump over the harry potter series it's just never going to happen so that's that if you have not watched it get with the program the acting is stellar the writing off the charts the plot unbelievable like just amazing just amazing and i have still yet to start reading the books i read the books when i was younger and one of my friends sent me this the whole collection and i actually just looked at it yesterday and i said okay i think i finally can sit down and start because i had so much stuff going on like so much stuff studying for real estate license and then getting my real estate license trying to learn how to be a realtor now i'm good but now back to trader joe's, trader joe's versus whole foods they like first of all trader joe's does not sell any like the stuff that you see in the regular store everything you get in there will be good for your body so that's the first thing you don't even have to worry about like looking at the ingredients and which i have i still have been looking at them just to see but you don't have to worry about looking at the ingredients or you know wondering you know what you're purchasing whole foods whole foods and they have way more aisles and way more options for stuff um like they actually have they actually have an in-store like restaurant thing but um they have a deli they have like a meat section where there's a butcher there where you can get fresh cut meats um a, of course a seafood section there all of those different things but like so many different healthy options and they also don't sell anything that's not good for you like their chip aisle will not contain no hot cheetos <laughs> no hot bunions no hot pups like you won't see none of that so and like all of their products and spices and things are like all natural their fruits their meats all of that is so good for you like i love Publix, but you can go in there and you can definitely get you some stuff that ain't good for you so i have just really been on a health kick and i just want to be more conscious as a mom more specifically to make sure like i'm doing my due diligence as a parent to um and it's also the the woman of the house like i pretty much jeremy cooks a lot so shout out to my man because my man does not leave me to do all the cooking and cleaning well i do more of the cleaning but my mom is there too so my mom cleans a lot so shout out to you mom if you're watching this but um i don't mind because babe definitely like if i say oh i need a whole week i don't want to cook he will cook the entire week like no issues and it won't be like your generic meals like it will be a real meal that he's throwing down so i'm so grateful for that but ultimately like i still am for the most part in charge of like the meals that we eat and the snacks and all those different things so i just want to make sure like i'm giving our family like healthier options um and then we can sometimes indulge in like fast food because like i know i could have just go up there to that popeyes real quick even though y'all saw me at popeyes did the vlog but i had no choice that day because there was nothing taken out and the girl's schedule had got the best of me and then i had to work all day so it was just a lot going on but um i told myself okay that was our nice little cheat for the month and we're back to our regular schedule program i'm sticking to that so that's why i have not eaten because i can go to mcdonald's or go and get something but i was like let me just be real mindful and i've been looking up so many different things of cooking um so i'm gonna cook something different i've never tried it before um and I'll take y'all along with me in the kitchen. But anyway, y'all, let me listen to my music and then we'll start um, watching my court shows 
and I'll see y'all later because I got a good 30 minutes before I get home. Y'all, <laughs> this is like the only, not the only song, but this is like one of the only songs that literally can have me cry over and over and like this song is so freaking beautiful. Like y'all, this song is so beautiful. Like. I'm getting married to this song and I'm gonna cry like a fucking baby walking down the aisle. Like, I, and y'all gonna be there too. Hey, I need to probably invite 15 keys <laughs> and two duns. I'm just playing. But seriously, y'all, like, I love this song so freaking much. I wish there was no copyright rules, y'all, because I would give y'all the performance of a lifetime. Like, I love this song. It's just so emotional and so beautiful. Like, when you think about it and, like, when you have your person, when you have that person, like, in your life that, like, brings all these feelings out of you, it just makes it all the more beautiful. Like, oh, my gosh. Like, I'm crying like a baby born down this highway. Yeah, okay, exactly. I want to share with y'all what I got. So I got, I love this flavor last time, the sparkling strawberries. So I got this one. Yeah. And this is just so I don't have to drink. Um, Mom, what is this for? Mommy. <laughs> and I got, this is something I never cooked with, but I was in one of the recipes Mommy, I didn't say. Mommy, why you get to drink so it? So I got some of this. Mommy, why you get to drink um, it? Which is so freak out. Then I got some uh, green uh, goddess uh, seasoning. Uh, I got uh, onion salt. Uh, uh, I got a salmon rub. Uh, so this is going to be real good. Then I got some taco mix. Y'all just got a whole bunch Mommy, of random stuff. And this is the stuff I'm about to like cook for dinner. And then one of the dishes I'm about to make. And then I got this. My mom said she don't like this meal. But I like it. Good job, baby. Then I got some detergent. All natural. I know, baby. Hey, y'all. I just finished prepping dinner with the girls. Because they come down here and they want to be a part of it. Wait, let mommy get the shrimp out. Let me get the shrimp. I'm going to give you the seasoning. Joy, you're going to go first because you all did the salmon. Okay, let me see. Y'all yeah, thought I was recording nothing I wasn't. Oh, Lord, let me see. It's not really doing mm. it. didn't have any lemon juice, but the recipe is going to have lime in it. Y'all know I'll be remixing. I look at the recipe and then I figure out what works best for me. Um, this is the hand. The, Free hand is what you use to season the glove hand is what you use to put it all in there. Go ahead. The free hand. Use your free hand. Your boo boo still hurt? Okay, that's enough. Thank you. Well, I put water in my group. No, we're not gonna use the salmon rub. Okay. Uh, so y'all won't believe this. I still haven't eaten at all. I finished making the appetizer. It turned out really bomb. Didn't eat it because I looked up and it was for something. And I was like, oh, I gotta make dinner by 5.30. So anyways, I'm cooking like a seafood rice with salmon. Um, dish so I guess we'll just have an appetizer and I'm just cutting I made a cut up cut up some shallots turn this on low cut up some shallots and some peppers we can add some red peppers to this too but I think we're running out so this is all and then I got my organic rice yes y'all y'all gonna keep hearing me say organic this is a vegan rice as if rice can be vegan I was so confused about that but it says it's vegan so it is what it is y'all i got that from whole foods i don't remember maybe so i got it from whole foods yeah, so i'm gonna just cook this i'll add my rice and water and let that cook all in for about 15 to 20 minutes let me take that out and then 
put up my, I let my salmon has been marinating since I got home, so for about two hours now, and then I'll make bite-sized salmon and cook it over here. This is an update of how everything's looking. The last update I'll have is when it's all finished. I'm thinking about keeping the shrimp tails and making. Y'all, please comment below if you know what to do with these shrimp tails. I saved them last time, uh, like a while ago, like months and months ago. Um, and I just left them in the fridge and I never came back to them. So let me know, like, should I process them? Like, chop them up in a food processor? Like, I know people be taking that bowl and be, like, grinding it together to make, like, a shrimp paste. But, y'all, please let me know if you are from the islands or I don't know exactly the culture. I don't want to be ignorant, but I don't know exactly the culture that does it the most. But if you're one of those cultures, please tell me a dish that I can make or something I can use it for. Um, but yeah, so I added my new seasonings that I got. Yes, baby. Yeah, I want an appetizer. Okay, you got my mom. This is my mom's plate. I already gave baby plate, and then I just gave my mom her plate. Now I'm about to make the girls their plate. Daddy, don't like that. Master Danny, eat and tell me your thoughts. I'm just loving this whole new thing I'm doing for the family and being more conscientious of our diets and stuff. It's time consuming, but I do like it. I gotta just be more mindful, because I should've damn made this whole thing feel like to have leftovers for tomorrow, but it's okay. Daddy, not on um, journey. That's what it looks like, y'all. Yeah, a journey. Everybody's tearing it up. Yeah. What well, adults are. What well, a journey is, too. Put that iPad in. Hey, guys. So, it's the day of my first Hi. closing. I'm on my way. Yes, yes, yes. So, y'all, this is the outfit of the day. Thank God I bought this at the last minute. It goes good. All my, my bra's tucked in. Can't see anything. Keeping it real, keeping it simple. My black. I already did my closing video, so thank God for that. So anything extra content is just extra. Um, I gotta head out. <sighs> you guys, it's been such a crazy, hectic day. I gotta bring my real estate bag in here while. Yeah, I got. I got. I got my earrings, baby. I gotta. But where's earrings? I got the small ones. We're gonna do the video when mommy come back. Mommy gotta bring her. Chargers. Yo, I'm excited. I gotta get out of here though, y'all, because it's like 30 minutes before my closing, and I'm like 30 minutes away from my closing. So I added my brooch, y'all, to my outfit um, to just judge it up, give it a little bit more uh, of that classy sophistication, y'all. Oh, yes, y'all, we just wrapped it up. We're done. Signed, sealed, delivered, closed. Got the keys, got the paperwork done, got the checks. And everybody happy. <laughs> so babe made me a celebratory dinner in lieu of my first closing. Um, oh y'all, my boobs. Oh, I wanted to come home and take my bra off, and I forgot. Like I can't do that for eight weeks. Yesterday I hit week three. I'll probably show y'all an update next week sometime. Jordan, let me see how much you got on. She, Mom, she put two lipsticks on. No, Jordan, you only need one. Only one. Now let's wipe some of it off. One off. You still got lipstick. Well, when, it, when it fades away, you're gonna. That's why you have your purse with you to reapply. Yes, Jordan need to bring her purse. Cause we's not gonna have no lipstick more. So Jory, you bring your purse and make sure you share with us. Cause we don't got, cause we don't got lipstick. I'm about to put it in the trash. Doing my makeup, I'm about to take the girls makeup. to the mall. I told you guys I wanted to go perfume shopping. Or did I tell you? I don't know. But I've been saving up. <laughs> like I have a file or like a saved folder in my phone 
of a plethora of different perfumes and I didn't want to just order them based off of, you know, some someone's recommendations. I need to smell it. Like I literally need to smell it. Smell it. And I was going to go yesterday before my closing, but I was like there's no way. And then the girls start saying they want to come and I'm like, "You know what? Let me let the girl let me introduce the girls to the finer things in life and let them start shopping with me whenever I'm doing like luxury shopping. I'm actually going to get them there first. I don't know what I'm going to do. So don't hold me to it. We're going to go on Sephora and I'll decide. They love lip gloss. They love perfume like literally literally they're so girly okay guys i'm dressed let me prop y'all up this is my outfit of the day i worked it out so this is my outfit of the day she is still a big deal we're gonna get a quick little video oh hold on what i hate when my bra's like showing hey you happy baby yeah but want to go in mommy baby just change the shoe That's right. Is it tight? Let me see. All you're doing is making it tight, Jeremy. You can walk forwards words on the floor and backwards, but not the stairs. Because you will fall. Exactly. So what's she talking about? She a big girl now. What's she talking about, Jory? Because she, she thinks she's taller than everybody else. She is tall, but that don't mean she can walk down the stairs backwards. Journey, don't walk down the stairs backwards anymore. Come on. I think my purse, my keys in my purse. I can't even tell, but I guess I'll find out when we get to the, oh, hold on, let me turn the alarm on. Oh, come on. Let's say bye, right here. Cute girls, so cute. Get it, girl, get it, girls. Y'all, so we're at the mall. It seems more spaced out, but I'm assuming like there's some things that were in the middle that's this not right there anymore. They are sad because as soon as we come in, we see an escalator. They're saying keep saying elevator, but it's es I see, baby. We're going to go get y'all purses. I'm trying to make a reel for them to have their first diva high-end shopping experience and vlog at the same time but y'all know i gotta be mindful of the dang on security walking by so yes we're gonna get whatever you all want you don't gotta do that part now <laughs> that made her happy okay that makes she wanted to spin around and you know her because that's your twin wait where the hell is victoria's secret oh my gosh we we're gonna go on victoria's secret but they're Unfortunately, oh, and they got a Savage X Fenty, y'all. Like, what in the world? They have a whole Savage X Fenty. Luckily, they still have Sephora, and they have get three items. I don't know what y'all. The girls talking about they want these purple purses. Barbie, it got a strap with it, so I'm gonna just. And the Barbie was uh oh. The It's not plastic. I'm fantastic. Come on, Barbie. George just woke up, so she's not all energetic. I think these are the purses we're gonna go with. Oh, there's some more purses over here. Oh, look at these purses, baby. Okay, y'all, we're leaving store number one. We didn't do that bad. We only spent like 130. They got purses. It's, it's gonna be a real showing everything, but they got, ladies, let's go down this ramp. Right here. They got purses and they got all things beauty. I let them get some jewelry. And when you know when you're checking out and you they got that whole kiosk in Forever 21 with filled with like so much. So they just went in there. I see baby, we're gonna definitely have to eat here because they're like obsessed with eating here. Oh, the security's looking at us. I'm gonna put the camera up by y'all. Yeah. 